Hello and welcome to this episode. In this episode, we're going to log into Packet Tracer. In last episode, we installed Packet Tracer. So going on, uh, in this episode, we're going to log into Packet Tracer. So let's get started. As we have Packet Tracer installed, so let's just go to Start menu, search for Packet Tracer, click, and Packet Tracer will be launched. However, when you open Packet Tracer for the first time, it asks you to log in. And uh, it is important, it is uh, essential that you have a Cisco Networking Academy ID to be able to log in to Packet Tracer. So, uh, in one of our episodes in uh, downloading uh, Packet Tracer, we created a Cisco Networking Academy account. Uh, you can refer to that episode if you want to uh, on how you can create the account. I've shown you there and I will put the link in, in the description below as well. So, you can just go there directly. Uh, so, go there and create an account for yourself, then come back here and uh, always for me this is my home computer so I'll just use this option to keep me logged in for three months I'll, I will click on this one it will ask me for the email ID that I used bef uh, for, uh, for, NISC, uh, for Cisco Networking Academy I will, I will enter my credentials Next, it will ask for my password. I am entering my password and log in. So, as you can see, you are now logged in and you can start playing with packet tracer do whatever you want to do so everything is set and ready to go uh, i hope uh, to s okay maybe I, th I can let you know about one more thing sometimes if you just want to log out and exit so you just want to log out and use another credential for your next session so you can click the, uh, this button exit and log out otherwise if you just normally want to exit without logging out from your account you can create uh, you can click exit that's it and i hope to see you in the next episode thank you very much and stay tuned